Hey guys, Munchmo back with another Loot Crate unboxing video. This one is for February 2016 and the theme is dead. So without further ado, even though I know this one's late too, we are going to go ahead and proceed. Who would have guessed that Deadpool would be the main theme for the dead themed Loot Crate? Well, let's check it out, shall we? Obviously, we're going to start with our shirt, which is, once again, as we expected, a Deadpool shirt. Voila. Looks like he is really interested in some tacos there. Um, that's Deadpool for you. <laughs> Still haven't seen the movie. Maybe I should get around to doing that. I don't know. We've got a Q-Fig Deadpool. Ooh, that's cool. It looks like he is... Falling down here, landing on something crazy. Yeah, it's like, pew. oh, I see. Okay, he's uh, eating in the blazing doorknobs. Okay, I got you. I got you. This is his, one of his maneuvers or something. Again, I'm not super familiar with Deadpool, so I don't know the inside jokes and whatnot. So I'll go ahead and stick that right up there. And then we've got our loot crate pin again here. This one is the loot pin for February. Um, I like the fact that they've done away with the buttons and they're giving us pins now instead. That is nice. Ooh, AMC's The Walking Dead. What is this here? This is... contains one of the three collectible figures. It's either a zombie, or a Rick, or... Oh, Daryl. Hey, I almost forgot his name. Um, and there's no way to know without opening it, so we are just going to go ahead and... Um, there's no, like, tear here to open thing. I'm going to need scissors for this, maybe. Uh, uh, well, before I do that, we've got... Ears. Oh wow, these are. Oh, oh, that's cool. It's soap, soap on a rope, which is the Daryl's ear necklace. That's why it's so heavy because it's soap. There is absolutely nothing that could get me to actually use this as soap, unless maybe it is the zombie apocalypse and this is the only soap I have on, you know, on hand or whatever. That's really, really cool. I like it. Um, I have to figure out how to open this thing. I, I can't, I can't open this thing. Let me. Uh, I'll be right back. All right, all it took was just a slight thing there. Oh, and look at that, even cut this thing. What is this? This is... Um, win a McFarland Toys shopping spree. Ooh. Would you like to win? Oh, they got a lot of cool stuff here. But let's forget that and see which figure I got. Um, I think I got the zombie. I can't tell. It has to be put together. So let's just go ahead and do that, shall we, here? We've got our base, and it actually has instructions on how to put it together. Um, there's our instructions. Let's just stick it right there so we can view them. Um, we got some arms. We got body bits. Okay, let's see. What is this? Okay, so this is the body. So that means this little bit goes like that, I think. Oh, it doesn't snap together very well. Uh, there we go. Okay, so that's that. Yep, I definitely got the zombie. And then we've got, what is this? This is a leg. How do I know which leg is which? Uh, I think this one is that side, maybe. I hope. I hope I'm getting it right. Otherwise, I'm going to be so pissed because then I have to pull it all apart. Let's find the other leg here. Or is this? Nope, let's find an arm instead. This one I know. This one's really easy. Check it out. I don't, I don't know if you can even see this stupid thing as I'm putting it together, man. It's so tiny and my hands are so big. You know what they say about people with big hands, right? Big gloves. Yeah, you saw that coming. And this is the head. Oh my god, this thing's head is enormous compared to the rest of its body. Jesus. Wow. All right. <laughs> Look at how big that head is. Oh my god, it's like the size of its torso. That is crazy. Now, is this... I think I got the right feet on the right side. I hope I got the right feet on the right side. Oh, I see. And then that one is made so that it kind of snaps over this thing here. Ah, it's gonna get you. Ah, the giant head. It can't focus in on this face. The camera. Ah, but there you go. There's my little zombie figurine thing that isn't quite put together great as it could be. And then, of course, we've got our magazine, which talks about all the cool things and all the nifty stuff. And, uh, yeah. Love iZombie, which is weird that there's nothing iZombie in here. 
So why are they have an I article about iZombie, but they don't have any sort of iZombie related stuff in the box this month? Huh, I don't know. And there you go, there's our figurines and soap and rope necklace and our pin and stuff. But that is all the time I have today for this Loot Crate unboxing video. Remember, if you enjoyed this, please click the like button to show your support. And I will see you again soon with the next one. Bye-bye.